Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we'll be comparing two of Canon's popular zoom lenses. The RF 100-300mm f 2.8L and the RF 70-200mm f 2.8L ISUSM. We'll be taking a look at the size and features of each lens, as well as their image quality, to help you decide which one might be better suited for your photography needs. The Canon RF 100-300mm f 2.8L ISUSM which was recently announced is very versatile lens. However, it is also big and heavy. In contrast, the Canon RF 70-200mm f 2.8L ISUSM doesn't have the same reach but it is extremely compact and light. Additionally, it is significantly less expensive than the new RF 100-300 f 2.8. I know it is not a fair comparison in any way, but I wanted to illustrate how much of a difference having an additional 100mm of reach can make. Let's start by comparing the physical size of each lens. The RF 100-300mm is a bit longer than the RF 70-200mm, coming in at 323mm compared to 146mm. The 100-300mm is also heavier weighing in at 2,590 grams compared to the 70-200mm's 1070 grams. This makes the 70-200mm more portable and easier to carry around, while the 100-300mm might be better suited for photographers who need a longer focal length. Now let's take a look at the key features of each lens. Both lenses have a constant maximum aperture of f2.8, which is great for low-light photography and creating a shallow depth of field. However, the 100-300mm has a longer focal length range, which is great for wildlife and sports photography. On the other hand, the 70-200mm has a slightly faster autofocus and better image stabilization, which is great for handheld shooting and video. So, which lens is better? Well, it really depends on your photography needs. If you need a longer focal length for wildlife or sports photography, then the RF 100-300 might be the better choice. If you need better image stabilization and faster autofocus for handheld shooting and video, then the RF 70-200 might be the better choice. Ultimately, both lenses are excellent and it really comes down to your individual needs and preferences. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more camera and lens reviews. And don't forget to leave your thoughts and opinions in the comments section below.